Hey everyone, this is Lucky7DX and welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 94 slash Donkey Kong Gameplay slash whatever the heck I want to call it, we're on a plane. That shoots bullets on the inside, and that's perfectly fine. Anyway, so this level we have more of that wind drag thing that's really annoying. And the main mechanic here are these two switches. We need to keep this one off, we need to go get that other one. That's the big key to this level. Yeah, I know, not too exciting. First we're gonna get the hat, there we go. All bonus is done. Uh, just watch out for this, uh, little floppy kind of thing. Anyway, once this is open, because, I mean, the wind drag will make it harder to get past him. Once this is open, we can extend this all the way out there, and we can use that to go get the key. And run really slowly, because the wind's a big pain in the butt, but at least we can run faster back. We Okay, so we need to get the key down there, because that's where the thing is. So what we need to do is we need to throw it, run down here, and hit the switch quickly. And you'll have plenty of time to get the key before it falls. This level has a lot of those ones where we have to like really time the key, like drop the key and then do a bunch of things and time it really well. And those are always a bit stressful, I guess. Not as bad as that one level in the pyramid, though. That level is just crazy how on the dot you have to be. Well, okay, this one in here. Man, slots fail. Alright, this level is a huge pain in the butt. Actually, this world is actually a bit, quite a bit harder. This is where the difficulty of the game starts going a bit crazy. Alright, you want to freeze one thing over there, and then ride the other thing up to get it. I wonder if I can make that jump from here. Let's try it. Ah, okay, no. Can I make it from here? Oh, wow, I can. Awesome. That's, that's perfect. And now that that's frozen, that'll be less of a problem. And now we have to just get the three things here. Uh, the big, the big reason why this is hard is because if you fall from here, A, it takes forever to get back. B, you're probably gonna die actually, because you'll probably just die from the fall. It's still only a threat in this level, but it's a pretty potent one. I uh, switch so there, we'll stop these platforms, but there's no reason to do that really. What we need to do is we need to time this jump, jump here, go here, and there we go. So actually, probably the best strategy would be just to put the freeze the platform where that the top platform where it was. Oh, we'll at least that one this time. Because then you can do the double jump to get up there, and then you'll have that easy way to get down as well. Dunk Kong level, this one's kind of a pain. I wouldn't be surprised if I die here. What we need to do is you need to switch out hitting. I, that wasn't even fair. I fell in the gap between the platforms. Not even fair. Not even fair, Dunk Kong. All right, let's try this again. Yeah, this is where the game starts definitely getting a bit of more difficulty. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, ho, ho. okay, that was close. Okay, now we just wait for this platform, and then we have to avoid that electric thing in the middle, or we'll get shocked to death, and that's, uh, rather interesting. Okay, we're, we're good to go here. No problems, except for that bullet, but that's way too far away to matter. And nothing we duck on can do. We come up to you. You run away. You run away, little coward. I don't know why I'm making fun of it. Anyway. anyway, so this one just kind of introduces the cannons. Well, I don't know why the cannons need for introduction, but oh well. Unfortunately, the next stretch's levels of levels are pretty hard and annoying, so this is going to be interesting. We'll see how this turns out. So far, not too bad, though. Alright. Trying to remember what the next level is. I don't remember. I don't remember what the next level is. What's coming up? Oh, this, okay, this one's actually fun. I like this one. The cannons will fire in a pattern of one horizontal, then one diagonal, then vertical, and then back to the diagonal. Uh, that's a bit high, but that shouldn't be a problem. Oh, poopy. That was poor. I oh, okay, that was lucky. Oh, okay, that was even luckier. Sure, why not? Make it, make it, make it. Oh, come on. Ah. Ladders are a pain. I could probably just do jump double jumps up here, but uh, whatever. All right, now it's the simple matter of bringing the key down without being shot. But considering they're going vertical right now, this shouldn't be a problem. Yep, we're all good to go here. Well, I deserve to die about twice there, but hey, why not? I survived because I'm a survivor. All right, and oh, we almost got two hammers. That the three hammers that also would have been one life. Gee, that's a little stupid to have game three in a row only be one life and for some items. That's kind of stupid. This level is annoying. Uh, as you can see, we have more wind. I am in the clouds, actually, for this one. I don't know why. 
Uh, here's where it's annoying. Uh, let's see if I can get this right. You'll see why if I screw it up. If not, I'll explain it. Come on, make it, make it, make it, make it! Nope. See, right there. That's... I, uh, I hate that. The wind blows you enough where you actually roll to the right and right into the spike pit. And, uh, it's just really hard to stop yourself from doing that. So, uh, I'm gonna cut until I get it right. Nope. Oh, the death count is gonna go up so high after this. Oh. Bullshit. Bullshit! Bullshit. Alright, let's do this again. Come on. Make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Yes! Okay. Now it's just a little matter of jumping back. Because you can make these gaps with thanks to the wind. And we're gonna drop a key, but that's okay. We're good to go. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Just two deaths and a couple of really stupid fails on my part because I'm an idiot. Okay, cool. Hey, it's one of these things. Let's see if we can get. Not a. Well, that's definitely gonna be a one because I pressed that way too early. What is it? This is the eighth video? One out of eight isn't bad, I guess, for not getting one at the beginning. No, that's horrible. This level is long. Okay. Uh, at least. Well, it's really long if you want to get the things in the middle, which I'll show you how to get. Or at least the way I get them. Maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Quite possible, but hey. Alright, but the main thing is we need to come up here. We need to get the key down these levels. What you do this is you hold here and hit the switch over, then go down and grab the key. We have to do this process three times. This ladder doesn't matter, I think. Alright, so let's do this again. Over to the right. Go down. Grab the key and do it again. And now he's gonna use this ladder this time to go down because this one doesn't have a ladder. And we can grab the key. Normally we go over here to get the uh, exit, but we're gonna actually lose the key right now and do this whole process over again because I'm gonna use the key to get up to the top here. Oh god. Okay. Um. So yeah, this is how you get the three items up here, at least that I can think of. Uh, and then you have to just basically do the whole process over again unless you die! Alright, I'm gonna cut. Alright, I showed you guys how to get all the stuff up there, I'm not gonna bother getting it again, it takes too long. Um, but basically the door is this one up here. So yeah, that's how you do it. Uh, this level's just uh, annoying, I don't really like it. But hey, we're gonna fight Donkey Kong now! That's so, yeah. And, of course, because the airplane's all about the wind, this one's all about the wind as well. But actually, it's not too bad. Especially because it lets you really... What? Wow. Do I always have to miss my first barrel? Really? Really, game. But anyway, it's not too hard because you do get a lot of... Wow. Okay, maybe it is hard because I'm an idiot and I didn't plan that out well at all. But okay, let's try that again. <laughs> I did it. Wow, okay. Um, about that. Donkey Kong, you're playing dirty. Actually, I'm just an idiot, but that's okay. We'll just pretend that didn't happen. Alright, game over. Wow. <laughs> Just wow on that other death. That was hilar That was both hilarious and really sad. Anyway, the next mechanic that we get to see is uh, the the fact that there's these ice blocks and a fire walk in them will melt them. So that's going to play take place in our next world, which, well, in case you haven't been able to guess right now, it's the ice world of the game. Yep, apparently this plane's taking us from the desert to the Iceland, or the ice, Iceland or Iceberg. It's the Iceberg. I love the music here. It's really cool. It's very fitting for an ice world, but uh, on that note, I'm pretty sure we're out of time by now. Okay, we actually do have time. Let's do stage 7 one quickly. Uh, Alright, so this is another level that pretty much forces you to learn about the fire thing because we're trapped in here until this thing comes and frees us. Come on, fire guy. Come on. 
There we go. All right, so now we can head up here and we can go free two more fire guys to take care of the rest of the ice blocks. The fire guys will be right here. All right. And do yourself a favor and just close this to save yourself some time. Oh, uh, well, actually, no. I like need this to go. No, wait. I forgot this control is the thing. All right. Well, it doesn't matter because we're going to have to waste some time waiting for these guys to burn everything anyway. All right. Now that we've burned the things, it's basically just about finishing the level now. Which, uh, you want to close this thing and then fall down and grab the key. It's one of those, ditch the key, then do some switch stuff, then come get it. Not hard. Not hard at all. See so, ya. Yeah. Now we're definitely out of time, so... Uh, we're gonna call it a video here. Uh, this is Lucky7DX, and stay tuned for more Iceberg. Ice World. Ice Physics. Oh no. Yep. Alright. See you guys next time.